What's up guys, Chicks there from Chicks Tech Reviews. So today I've got my hands on the GJT Wireless Smart Video Doorbell. So this is a wire-free 720p HD video doorbell. It has built-in Wi-Fi, night vision and lots more. So let's just get it out of the box and see what it looks like. So this is everything you get in the box, beginning with a user manual, quick start guide. Now over here we have a chime. You would plug it anywhere inside your house, up to 20 meters away from the actual doorbell. Now we have some fixtures and screws here. We've got a industrial standard double-sided 3M sticker. We've got two wires and we'll find out what they're for in a bit. We've got a micro USB charging cable. And last but not least, the brand new GJT wireless video doorbell. So here it is people. Okay, so first thing that hits me is it's very premium quality. You've got a aluminium front over here. The actual doorbell button is nice and big and you've got LED lights going around it. So every time you press the doorbell, that's gonna light up. So there is a 720p camera built in with a 166 degree wide angle lens. This supports night vision. So you've got infrared night vision and it will automatically switch to night vision when necessary. You also have a built in speaker so you can do two way conversations from your smartphone, just like how an intercom works. There is also a built in eight gigabyte micro SD card built into the doorbell. And this doorbell will also give you access to free cloud storage. So everything the camera captures will also be saved online. And this is very easy to set up. All you do is have a look at the instructions, download the smartphone app, and you will be set up in no time. So I'll quickly show you how this works. You, get, you can get the 3M sticker, stick it on there, peel it off on both sides and stick it to your wall. Or you can use the more permanent fitting, the fixtures and the screws provided. Once you stuck this to the wall, you can actually remove the front part every time you need to charge or change the batteries. So what you do is, while this is stuck on the wall, all you're doing is pushing down slightly and then you take this part off. So this part will still be stuck to the wall there is also a screw that you, you can put into the top so that would prevent anyone just taking this off with ease so that's going to be useful so it's quite, so it's a good idea to put a screw inside there a tiny screw um, which is in the bag as well and i will do that in a bit so once you take this off the wall you can go inside you can charge this up micro usb charging port um, and inside you have two 2600 milliamp batteries so these are the 18650 model batteries. So the system is designed to give you an ultra long standby time. So you can expect the batteries to last weeks, if not months, and you can recharge the batteries with a universal charger or with the included micro USB charging cable. Now these two wires are completely optional. Um, they included these, if you see inside the base plate, you'll be able to screw these on and the wire would come out on the other side and basically if you didn't want to use batteries, you can make your own wired connection. So the option to have a wired connection is there, should you want it. Just in case you're someone who doesn't want to worry about charging this up, you have the option to go wired. All right, so I'm going to pull these out. So this is what the battery looks like. Let's put them in. And that's what you can expect, a red light. The doorbell rings there, but you've also got a chime, which I'm going to plug in and give you a demonstration. We've got the chime plugged in. Here is the doorbell over here. We've got the batteries installed. So you grab your phone, open up the QR scanner app, and in the instruction manual, you will see three codes, iOS, Google Play, or direct download for APK. So I'm just going to go to the Google Play version. If I can scan, there you go. So, so this is the app you need. If you want, you can just search for the app directly. All right, so let's open up the app. So we have successfully connected the wireless doorbell to the app and we're ready to go. So here is our doorbell. If we click on play, it will give you an immediate live stream. So that is a live stream. You can see my hand moving around. It's in real time and it works great. All right, so we're gonna give it a test now. So here's my phone. I'm gonna press the doorbell and we're gonna see if it connects. front doorbell is calling so we answer it and this is what we get so we've got a built-in intercom so right now I could just speak I can press the mic button so this is the, so intercom. This is the intercom 
I am talking into my phone and you should be able to hear everything clearly. Okay, not only that, you can also take a photograph. You can just hit the photograph button and you can take a snapshot of the person at your front door or you can immediately start recording video. So now we are now recording video. Okay, at the bottom it says album, cloud storage, cruise, voice and settings. You've got a whole bunch of settings here including PIR detection. So you can set it to high, medium or even disabled. You've got your SD card settings here. Cloud storage is actually off at the moment. We're just using SD. You can switch on cloud storage. So now everything can be saved to the cloud automatically. You don't have to do anything. If you didn't want to use cloud storage, you can easily switch it off. You've got your device name and password, your share QR code, the name, ID, model, firmware version, vendor, and you can check for updates. You've also got at the top SD quality, SD video. You click on that, it will switch to HD video. And uh, I'm gonna have to test it out again. So everything is now set up and paired. Here is the chime right here, plugged in. So let's give it a test. So as you can see, it's working fine. We've got a live feed there. So the chime itself has over 52 different melodies and I'll let you hear some of them. And you can change the volume. Now I want to test out motion detection, PIR. So if somebody just approaches the house but doesn't press the doorbell, it could be an intruder or it could be someone nosy, your neighbor or something. So let's see what happens. So as you saw, that was motion detection. So a call got triggered just by motion detection. I didn't do anything else. It's a PIR detection. And as soon as it detects movement, it will ring your phone. So there you have it, guys. That was the new GJT wireless video doorbell. Now this product is a very effective security system, which I think every household needs. Now to be able to purchase a wireless video doorbell system with intercom and motion detection for under $100 and you can fit this in yourself within a few minutes is quite amazing because a similar system few years ago without the Wi-Fi would have easily cost $1000. So what's impressive is modern technology is not only sophisticated and easy to use but it's also now becoming very affordable. So you've seen how this works and you know what it can do. And if you think you need this for your home or office, then do check out the links in the description box below. Meanwhile, thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. See you in the next one, guys.